of a database. Lecture number five. Other database models. Three tier database architecture. There is our plan of the lesson. Number one is the entity relationship model. Number two is the object oriented model. Three is extended relational data model. Number four is the external model. Number five is the conceptual model. Number six is the internal model. And the final seven is three tire database architecture. There is our references of the lesson. Database models. First, network model, then hierarchical model, relational model, entity relationship data model, mainly for database design. Number five is object-based data models, object-oriented and object-relational. And number six is semi-structured data model, XML. The development of data models. There is a diagram. You can look at it and read yourselves. The entity relationship model. Widely accepted and adapted graphical tool for data modeling. Introduced by Chen in 1976. Graphical representation of entities and their relationships in a database structure. The Entity Relationship Model continued. Entity Relationship Diagram ERD Use graphic representations to model database components. Entity is mapped to a relational table. Entity instance or occurrence is row in table. Entity set is collection of like entities. Connectivity labels types of relationships. Diamond connected to related entities through a relationship line. Entity relationship data model, mainly for database design. Widely accepted and adapted graphical tool for data modeling, introduced by Chen in 1976. Graphical representation of entities and their relationships in a database structure. The Entity Relationship Model Basic Structure Entity Relationship Diagram ERD Use graphic representations to model database components. Entity is mapped to a relational table. Then Entity Instance or Occurrence is row in table. After it, Entity Set is collection of like entities. And then Connectability labels types of relationships diamond connected to related entities through a relationship line the entity relationship model continued the basic chain erd a one-to-many relationship a painter can paint any paintings each painting is painted by one painter a many to many relationship an employee can learn many skills each skill can be learned by many employees and one-to-one -one relationship an employee manages one store and each store is managed by one employee the object oriented model modulate both data and their relationships in a single structure known as an object Object-Oriented Data Model OODM, is the basic basis for the Object-Oriented Database Management System OODBMS. OODM or Object-Oriented Data Model is said to be a semantic data model. The Object-Oriented Model continued. Object described by its factual content, like relational models entity, includes information about relationships between facts, listen objects, and relationships with other objects, unlike relational models entity, 
and then subsequent OODM developments allowed an object to also contain all operations. Object becomes basic building block for autonomous structures. The object-oriented model continued. The object is an abstraction of a real-world entity. Attributes describe the properties of an object. Objects that share similar characteristics are grouped in classes. Classes are organized in a class hierarchy. Inheritance is an ability of an object within the class hierarchy to inherit the attributes and methods of classes above it. The object-oriented model, semantic data model (CDM). Developed by Hammer and with Leon Leon in 1881, 1981, modeled both data and their relationships in a single structure known as an object. Basis of object oriented data model OODM. OODM becomes the basis for the Object-Oriented Database Management System OODBMS. The Object-Oriented Model continued. Object is described by its factual content, like relational models entity. Includes information about relationships between facts within object and relationships with other objects. Includes information about relationships between facts within objects and relationships within other objects, unlike relational models entity. And after its subsequent OODM development allowed an object to also contain operations. Object becomes basic building block for autonomous structures. The object-oriented model continued. Look at this picture and read it. Object-oriented data model, basic structure. Object, abstraction of a real-world entity. Attributes describe the properties of an object. Objects that share similar characteristics are grouped in classes. Classes are organized in a class hierarchy. Inheritance is the ability of an object within the class hierarchy to inherit the attributes and methods of classes above it. A comparison of the OO model and the ER model. Customer generates invoice has line. Object relational data model, the new extended version of relational database technology called Object Relational Database Management System, also known as ORDBMS. Uh, an ORDBMS supports an extended form of CQL called SQL3 that is still in the development stages. The extensions are needed because ORDBMS have to support ADTs. The ORDBMS has a the relational model in it because the data is stored in the form of tables having rows and columns and SQL is used as the query language and the result of a query is also table or tuples, rows. Semi-structured data. Semi-structured data models allows information from several sources with related but different properties to be fit together in one whole, thus suitable for integration of databases and the sharing information on the web. Semi-structured data is data that may, may be irregular or incomplete and have a structure that may change rapidly or impractically. It generally has some structure but does not conform to a fixed scheme. 
schemeless and self-describing data carries information about its own scheme. It, in terms of each uh, XML element text, other models, extended relational data model, ERDM. Semantic data model developed in response to increasing complexity of applications. DBMS, based on the ERDM, often described as an object relational database management system or RDBMS, primarily geared to business applications, database models, and the Internet. Internet drastically changed the role and scope of database market. OODM and ERDM ORDM have taken a backseat to development of databases that interface with Internet. Dominance of web has resulted in growing need to manage unstructured information. Data models A summary each new data model capitalized on the shortcomings of previous models. Common characteristics Conceptual simplicity without compromising the semantic completeness of the databases represents the real world as closely as possible. Representation of real world transformations behavior must comply with consciously and integrity characters of any data model. Data models, a summary, continued. Hierarchical network, relational entity relationship, semantic and after it object oriented and extended relational or object or relational. And there are some comments for them. Degrees of data abstraction. Way of classifying data models. Many processes begin at high level of abstraction and proceed to an ever increasing level of detail. Designing a usable database follows the same basic process. Degrees of data abstraction continued. American National Standards Institute ANSI. Standards Planning and Requirements Committee, SPRRC, defines a framework for data modeling based on degrees of data abstraction 1970s, external, conceptual, and internal. Degrees of data abstraction continued. End user view, end user view, external model, and after it conceptual model, then international model and physical model. The external model, end user's view of the data environment, requires that the modelers subdivide set of, of requirements and constraints into functional models that can be examined within the framework of their external models. The external model continued. Advantages easy to identify specific data required to support each business unit's operations. Facilitates designer's job by providing feedback about the model's adequacy. Creation of external models helps to ensure security constraints in the database design. Simplifies application program development. The external model continues. There is a scheme. You can look and read it yourselves. The conceptual model represents global view of the entire database. Representation of data as viewed by the entire organization. Basis for identification and high-level description of main data objects, avoiding details. Most widely used conceptual model is the entity relationship, ER model.
The conceptual model continued. There is a scream for you. The conceptual model provides a relatively easily understood macro-level view of data environment, independent of both software and hardware, does not depend on the DPMS software used to implement the model, does it depend on the hardware used in the implementation of the model, change the in Either hardware or DBMS software have no effect on the database design at the conceptual level. The internal model representation of the database as seen by the DBMS maps the conceptual model to the DBMS. Internal scheme depicts a specific representation of a internal model. The internal model continued. The physical model operates at lowest level of abstraction describing the way data are saved on storage media su such as disks or tapes. Software and hardware dependent requires that database designers have a detailed knowledge and the hardware and software used to implement database design. The physical model continued. Model, degree of abstraction, focus and the independent of. Models are external, conceptual, internal and physical. Degree of abstraction is high and low. End user video views and the conceptual is global view of data independent of database model internal is specific database model and the physical is storage and access methods independent of hardware and software conceptual is independent of hardware and software too and internal is independent of hardware and physical independent of Neither hardware or software. Object oriented model advantages OOM versus relational. The ability to display information about the complex relationships of objects. OOM can identify individual records, database, and the responsibilities of their treatment. And disadvantages OOM. High conceptual complexity, the disadvantages of the data and the low speed of queries. Examples database object oriented model, POET, POET software, Jasmine, computer associates, versant, versant technologies, no zero, zero two, ardent software, ODB, Jupyter, Научное определение центр, интеллект плюс, Ивриц, Орен и Постгриз. И есть несколько вопросов для вас. Номер один – что это за датабейс модели? Номер два – это концептуальные модели. Номер три – это логические модели. И номер четыре – это физические модели. И, наконец, пятый – это три-тиерная датабейс архитектура. Thank you for attention. Nazarlanzga Rahmed.